done? Okay, it's my turn. Oh good grief, I don't think this tree is worth it. <laughs> but let's play with the monsters. Okay, I've changed my mind. I definitely want to kill them. Got him! Yes, 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 I got him. Well, good morning. We're back in Middle Earth and joined by Master Dwarf Thormund to continue the deeds in the Shire. Now, when we left off, we had done the brigands and we had done the harvest flies, so we need to do wolves, which is not far away. I'm going to go ahead and speed him up. And we also want to do spiders. And if we have enough time, we'll go after some goblins too. All right, so this is the Bridgefield Wall. And that is not a wolf, that's a warg. He doesn't count, but we'll want to get him out of the way anyway. Oh, he brought a couple of friends with him. Very good. for me. As you can tell, there are plenty of wolves here to be had. All right. Any wolves at the farm itself? Looks like somebody was in here recently because I haven't seen. Of course, I could be at the wrong farm, which I am. The farm's over here. Oh, and we have a harvest fly too, which we absolutely didn't need, but we'll kill it. Okay, that one was easy. <clears throat> and of course, once I finish with the Shire, like I did with Eret Loon, I will calculate, total up how many Lotro points I got in the area. And at the end of everything, I'll... Like I said, I'll do some math, and I'll figure out how many Lotro points I got per hour. I guarantee the return is not that high. If you take into consideration, time is also valuable.
And we finished the first sla Wolf Slayer deed. So, now we're on to the advance. That. Okay, deed completed. Title awarded. Deed bestowed. We'll add that to the tracker. And we need 59 more of those. <clears throat> so we're up to five for the day already. another bold wolf over here. I think they're all pretty bold considering. And you can see the warg is already back. Even though he doesn't count, we're going to kill him again and get him out of the way. There. several over here, so. Oh, might as well. another thing about this is I am still using a cheap bow <clears throat> that doesn't have a lot of power. If I had a better bow, I would probably be killing them faster. Now that I've thought about that, I am half tempted to head to the AH and see if I can find something. And there's the warg again. Like he respawns quick because he's part of a quest chain. One that I'm not sure people do that much. Not even when uh, it was a newer quest. we not get something out of this backpack? Or did it respawn already? Oh. There we go. We are, 
I'm just about halfway there, though. So this really doesn't take that long. Even with the junkiest gear. should be back down here. now. How much junk do we have in this? A lot. <laughs> Not a white hides. Thirteen to go. Another backpack. Go figure. And it's in another wolf den. Nine. And that's the Brandywine River over there. <clears throat> People, 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 people. 
And that's it for walls. We have completed Wolf Slayer Advanced. So, we're halfway done with the Slayer Deeds. And... <clears throat> before we go up to the spiders, we're going to take ourselves down to Mickle Delving and check the auction house to see if there's perhaps a slightly better bow than what we've been using. We're also going to sell some junk off. And the stable is right over there, so no need to get on my horse for a short jaunt. We want to go... Oh. Must be a subscriber. Or have played this character while a subscriber, so we cannot take a swift from here to Mickle Delving. We can't even take a swift to Hobbiton. Um, yeah, we don't have time for that. We're going to use a Mithril coin and get there. Not my favorite use of a mithril coin, but they were free, and I don't use them really for anything else, so might as well. <clears throat> Why are we going this way? The auction house is this way, and so are vendors I can sell this junk to. In fact, here is the vendor hall. And I don't think the vendors have anything better. But you never know. I did say I was using junk. I'm pleased to be of service. Alright, so let's get rid of that. Cool. Get rid of that and that. And that and that. And that and that. And that that and I will hold on to the ore and the hides I'm pretty sure I have characters that can use them oh and there's an outfitter I'm pleased to be of service. they have different various generic outfits so you got a blacksmith's apron calvary hauberk a chef's apron a common long sleeve dress, and it goes on and on. There's even backpacks. And they're all pretty cheap, so, you know, they're absolutely basic cosmetics, but if you felt like decorating your character, it's a place to go. All right, I'm so what do to be you have? A short stick bow and a U-bow. <gasps> Yeah, I think what I have may be junk, but it's definitely better than that. So, our other place to go is the auction house. And that is right here in the Shire. And we have a lag, 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 we have a lag. Wow, that was some lag. I was not expecting it to take that long to enter the hall. Hello, Hello. Bungo. I would like to look at some weapons, please. Uh, something in the bow range for about level, I don't know, 12 to 15. I doubt there will be anything here, but we're going to look. There are two. We have an ash bow. Which is 21 to 39. And we have a fine ash bow. Which is 23 to 42. 
who so the low end of this one is actually only two points away from the high end of what i'm using it's 400 gold i will take it thank you all right not absolutely the absolute best one but much better than what she what he's using do we want to buy anything else? Let's see what you have for one hand. It axes in the same range. We have a fine iron axe, which is 10 silver. I will take it. Okay. Now, let's get him a little equipment on. Oh, yeah. It might help if I got it out of the mailbox first. <clears throat> when you buy in the auction house, it does not automatically go into your inventory. You have to come here to your mailbox and get it out of the mail. All right, so we'll swap the bow out. Absolutely, yes. We'll swap this out with, I think the 8 to 13 would be good. <clears throat> All right. And while we're here, where are those hides? They're there. But we don't need to sell them off right now. <clears throat> All right, so... Better bow, better axe, should provide faster killing. How do you do? How do you do? Hello there. Whoa, now that was some lag. Hello there. All right. Yeah. Where do we want to go? Brockenborns. <clears throat> so. need obviously if you were doing this to grind lp you wouldn't be using mithril coins to travel but at the same time i you wouldn't have left the area because you probably would have had the proper gear so And go over here, and this is the town of Scary. Town is a little bit of a, I don't know, exaggeration. There's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, not even a dozen hobbit holes here. Okay, so. I'm going to go past all these fine residents. And we have completed the sites of the Shire. <clears throat> the quarry was the last spot to go. And let's kill our first spider. <clears throat> and we have Spider Slayer. So, deed completed, virtue cap reached. Not that it really matters, but we have going charity, discipline, confidence. They're all max, so we'll just work on fidelity. And we have just started spiders. Okay. And Spider Slayer is pretty easy now and 20 regular spiders and 40 for the advanced
And there are plenty of spiders to be had here. I don't know where the wolf howling is coming from, but I can't imagine that it's coming from the spiders. <clears throat> And I think there is a player emote that lets them howl like a wolf. Which, obviously, Thorman doesn't have. But it could possibly be somebody's here that does have it. You look in here, there's usually two more spiders. Y'all are hearing this wolf howling, right? It's got to be either a player playing around with the emote <clears throat> or they have accidentally put a wolf in here somewhere. In which case, I will kill it. And we have a queen. Very good. And we've completed Spider Slayer. So we are halfway there. We have a bunch more junk again, because of course we do. We need 40 more spiders. more spires than that down here but now you've got this cave that you can go into when the game's not being a <clears throat> laggy mess and we're waiting Problem is, when we're waiting like that, there is a small chance that you've encountered a portal crash. But in this case, it wasn't so. And usually, that's just a function of not enough processor, not enough RAM. I know, because I used to portal crash a lot when I was playing this on my first machine. It was <clears throat> definitely not capable of running Lotro effectively. Oh good, we have a party going on here. Perfect. All right. <clears throat> you come in here. And this is where the spider mother came from, so it's empty. Come 
come down here. And another one. There actually should be one more spider mother down here. There she is. And we just one-shotted her, so she didn't bring any ads with her. <clears throat> That's too bad. We are almost halfway done with Advanced. There is another place in the Bindle Bowl Wood where you'll find spiders, but this is just so much easier. Okay, I was going to say, did these respawn yet? Yes, they did. Very convenient. Okay. Oh, hi. You weren't the one I was aiming for, but we'll kill you. Sight. Okay. Four more. And we're finished with Spider Slayer Advance. So, just that quick, we have made another 35 low tier points. I mean, the whole session, not just the spiders. Of course, we have one following us. Which the Bounder will take care of. 
Because surprisingly, these bounders actually have a shiny spine. Did you need something? Okay, do we have what can we sell? We can sell that. We can sell the old weapons off. We can sell that. And that. That. And loot all that. Get rid of some junk. Ring of the Mariner. Okay. All right. So let's see how much time we have left in just a moment. Okay. So I checked and we've only been at this for 36 minutes and that's including going to Mickle Delving to get a new weapon. We definitely do have enough time to at least get some goblins done. So, which we want to head up this way into this area that's not far from the entrance to Evendom. And we're going to find a camp full of goblins. And of course here you'll have a few wolves and some bears scattered about. Easy to avoid if you're on a mission. I think you even have a few uh, badgers too. And this guy here has a quest. You have to go recover his sheep or something, I think. Once again, we're not interested. And this is Borar's throat, which is Evendom. Which technically we don't want to go to Evendom. Thanks, but um, not really my goal for the day. So, we can get off our horse here, and pump up our focus, and let's take out some goblins. New D, Goblin Slayer. So, let's go ahead and... Look at the new deed. Yes, I know. And... Did they... Okay. So goblins are a little more than the other mobs. In this case, we have to kill 50 regular goblins and 100 for the advance. That can't be right. Oh no, that's enmity of the goblins. Okay. I have the wrong deed. Indeed, I have the wrong deed. Thank you. That looks a lot better. So, 30 and 60. But I guess since we have... I see that we're doing enmity of the goblins too, which we should finish by the time we're... Yeah, we'll finish because we only need 50 for that and we're going to have to kill 90. Okay. I 
to see how fast we can get this done. Now there is a cave full of goblins, but unless you've done the quest chain, you can't get into it. So we're stuck with just the goblins in the camp itself. Which should be more than enough. We're already at 12. I'm sorry, 13. imagine this would be a very nice pretty little spot if it wasn't for the fact that goblins have pretty much taken it over goblins up here. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Come here. And you see the stolen sheep over there? That would be that guy's quest that I was talking about. And... Okay. There are more goblins. Than just those few. first goblin slayer down. So. Need the stowed. Add the tracker. And we're halfway there. Actually, it's a good thing I went and got a new bow. You imagine how much longer these guys would take to kill. If I didn't have something halfway decent. Oh, I guess these do count.
that's not the right way. But this is Evendum. This is Borar's sword. And that town there is Oak Barton. Very charming little town. And actually, I think I've mentioned that when I was doing stuff there on Medriel, that people have used the town of Oak Barton for Hobbit roleplay before. Hi, excuse me. Can you give me directions? No? Okay. But you don't have to be so rude about it. Oh, there's another goblin down there. Now, my friend that I play this with knows this area better than I do. And he actually knows a better route to kill goblins than I do. But we're doing fine. So, we'll just keep going. Have somebody in here killing goblins too. Either they're doing it for a quest or they're also doing the deed. Still, these things respawn pretty quick. Completed Amity of the Goblins, which means we got another five Lotro points for that, I believe. I did. So we're up to, what, 45 Lotro points? And we are almost halfway done with advanced. We get this done quick enough, we might be able to get the slugs out too. Maybe. So, 27 out of 60. There is another way you can actually do the Slayer Deeds. If you were level 20, you could run the Skirmish Trouble at Tuckboro. And that will, that has goblins and brigands and wolves in it. And so those all actually do count for the Shire deeds.
By the same token, for Bree, there are there's the skirmish, defense of the prancing pony, that opens up around level twenty, that you can also do for Bree deeds. Thievery and mischief doesn't open up until a little later. That is, if it's still the same as it used to be, but. Um, That also counts for Bree Slayer Deeds. And it's usually just the brigands and... Not too much else. I don't know if the Barrow instances count towards Bree Deeds. Because I don't do them that much. Fifteen more. Oh, excuse me. Yeah. And Legion von Eriador is advertising again. They do seem like a pretty friendly kin. So if you were on Laurelin and you were interested in a kinship and maybe one that speaks Dutch as well as English, that might be something you'd be interested in checking out. Nine more. Two over here. Four to go. We are almost done with goblins. One more. Oh, looks like you're... Oh, you're a rare... You're an elite. Well then. Hi. Oh, this is fun. I don't get to see the elite here too often. Complete it, Goblin Slayer Advance. And we killed the, the elite. We're done. Let's get on our horse and get out of here. They can just chase us now. Excuse me. Get out of my way. Nice. I was not expecting to find a elite out there. Like I said, I rarely ever see an elite in that area. So that was actually extra fun. Let's see which way we had it. That was fun. 
how much time do I have left? Okay. Well, we can go a little tiny bit over an hour. Because we are literally down to our last layer deed. And we finished the exploration deeds. So... Yeah, all we have left is a slug, so let's see about getting those done. I'm just going to be lazy here for a minute. We're going to take a slow ride to Hobbiton. Get off just before the road turns down to Hobbiton. Because that'll be right near where the marsh is. Definitely have some distinct lag going on. So we want to get off right about here. Just past Overhill. And the swamp you can see is right there. the horse. Thank you. Okay. Head up this way. Nice little picnic area. And we can see the swamp directly ahead of us. So, Let's head down there. So we've managed to net 55 points and the slugs will make it 70. And there's a bog slug right there. New deed. Okay, let's pin that. And once again, they have made this one super easy. You only need 20 for regular and 40 for advanced. And a quick tip for killing the slugs. Don't just kill the slugs when you're in here. Kill the gnats and the toads too. Because then they have a chance of respawning as slugs. Which makes the process go a whole lot faster. Not to mention, you'll get a little extra junk to sell. Early on in the game, having some extra junk is always good. Okay, there's another slug here somewhere. There he is. Oh, and also watch out if you have a slug that's got a yellow, slimy-looking stuff around it. Don't walk in the slimy stuff. It slows you down. Okay, so, need to find more slugs. I get the feeling that I'm not the only one doing these today. Yeah, like I said, kill the toads too. Because... All of these things have a chance of respawning as slugs.
Okay, so we are where we at. Whoa, where are you? I know there's a slug here somewhere. Thirteen of twenty. Get back down into the swamp. Oh, there's a slug here somewhere. There he is. And another one. Nice. Yeah, yep. See, I just walked through some slimy stuff. And it does slow you down considerably. Not just a little bit. It's pretty potent stuff for a low-level crowd control skill. Yeah, it's kind of funny how the area looks different when you're on a character that's short. Slug Slayer. So now we're moving on to Advanced. And once again, we're going to... Uh, excuse me. Get on my way. Thank you. Go ahead and put that on our radar, radar which we did not do. For some reason. Oh, there it goes. Alright, so it's not my imagination. Somebody else must be doing these. And he got it before I... He waited for me to target it, and then he killed it before I could get to it. Rude. So, yes, yeah, somebody else is killing slugs, too. bet he's just killing slugs and nothing else. Oh, slug. Thank you. 
Okay. We go. Another one over here. Wow, they come out a little further than I usually expect them to. Well, we're at eleven of forty. True, that's not a slug, that's a toad. We'll kill it. That's a slug. This is probably the big annoying one, even though they have decreased it, and huh, trust me, I'm grateful for that. It is an annoying one because you've got to find so few of these creatures on such a large space. And if somebody else is doing them at the same time, it can be quite annoying to try to find enough to go between two people. Those are all toads. Alright, come on. We just need a few more. Like that one there. Oh, and we got a two for here. Okay. So we are at 17 of 40. Okay, come on. Maybe we should not get stuck in a tree, huh? That would be real good. There's another slug. Ah, right in our, right under our feet. Literally right under our feet. Okay. Button that needs to get taken off my computer, or off this keyboard. Okay. 
Plenty of toads. Not enough slugs. Go. We're getting there. We are getting there. Uh, slug. They name their character Booney. Oh, slug. the slug car. Okay. All right. Where are we down to? Eight. We have eight to go. Oh my, we're almost there. We're almost there. Like I said, killing everything really does help get the slugs to pop up. And it's kind of the same with other stuff. I've heard that if you kill the little landscape animals, which I don't like to do, supposedly they actually have a chance of respawning as an ore or wood deposit. I've never had problems finding deposits though, so that's not something I'm interested in doing. But this trick Killing everything to get the slugs really does work. And we're done. We have completed Slayer the Shire. We have completed every Slayer deed in the Shire. We have completed the two exploration deeds in the Shire. And that was wolves, wolves, spiders, goblins, and slugs today. So 60 points for that. 65, 70. So we got about 70 Lotro points. Just finishing off the Slayer Deeds and the One Exploration. So, yay, we're finished with the Deeds in the Shire. And, of course, our next and final step in this tutorial will be Breland. Woohoo! 
And like I said, as soon as I'm done with this video, I will add up how much low tour points I made today to be sure. And as well as how many low tour points I got all together in the Shire. So you know what to expect. And we had it. We're headed back to Mickle's Delving. We're going the right way. Okay, good. And the next episode will be in Breland and we'll be working on the Slayer deed, Slayer and Exploration Deeds there. And until next time, bye for now.